a patrol. Um, it was actually, it actually showed up in my, in my memories on Facebook yesterday. Um, he, I don't know if you guys know that patrol that raced the 918 on Sheikh Zayed Road several years ago. Um, that was on the Grand Tour. My husband built that patrol. That's why we came. Texas is desert. No, it's not all desert. Only half of it is desert. Um, I haven't done English lessons. I don't even know how to begin, but... I thought like, but I would need kind of direction of what kind, what kind of conversations you need to have. Cause you can obviously, I mean, you know more English than I know Arabic, right? Like I can't, I don't even know what an Arabic letter looks like. So you have a lot more to start with than what I would have to learn Arabic. So I feel like you could learn it pretty quickly. You probably just need to be around other people that speak English. Um, I mean, I don't know. I think you just have to be exposed to it. Been in UAE since 2015. Yep, in Dubai. Morocco, hey. If I say I like you, how do you see that? Um like how would I perceive it would be, I mean, it just depends on the context. Like if you're saying you like someone because you're interested in them, or if you just like them as a person for what they are about, what, I don't know. I mean, there's lots of people that I like, but I also really like my husband. <laughs> so I guess it just depends on the context. I didn't know if that was um, supposed to be like a pickup line or whatever or a genuine question, but. <laughs> so, so one of my friends here that is Serbian, he said that he learned English from watching movies. Um, and he understood a lot of cultural pop culture references that originate in the US that a lot of times when I'm when I will you know just accidentally mention something trying to I don't know be funny he actually gets the references um because he watched so many movies growing up so I don't know but so many movies from the US are trash these days so Uh, let me translate this. A free English content. Learn English from TV and books. That's cool. Like what TV shows did you watch? I mean, Depending on what your profession is, that might be a good idea is to find a TV, an American TV show that's relative to your field or your interests. And then the the type of conversation that you would want to identify with would be present in those TV shows, maybe. I'm not Muslim, no. <sighs> People ask me my my religion all the time. I don't I don't mind I don't mind people asking, but I didn't know if that was just because I live I didn't know if they were asking because I live in the Middle East and I'm American or if they're just genuinely curious, but I was watching this, 
um, British Moroccan girl on a live earlier this morning because she was speaking English. So in my live feed, most people are speaking Tagalog or Hindi or Arabic and I can't understand them. So I was like, just just curious of what other people were commenting. And so she was speaking English and just curling her hair. So I stopped and people were asking her the same questions, except for she was Muslim, but didn't wasn't wearing hijab and they were judging her hardcore. Um, and it was it was just it was just interesting. And but people were also asking her to marry her. So <laughs> I don't know if it's just this is the way it is in this uh, in the IP addresses over here or what. My job, uh, I, I just raise kids, but I also run a business with my husband. I do all of the like paperwork, accounting stuff, um, and he does the labor. <laughs> He works for me for free. I'm the lucky one. From Texas. <laughs>